In this tutorial, I will show how to create 2D drawings from an imported 3D model into Revit and use Revit's functionalities to create sections. To create section, I need to be on a plan view. And a plan view I can get to from my project browser, double click on the level I want to go to. And I can find the section function two ways. The section is up here in the quick menu. I can click on it and then I can click a starting point and then move the cursor to the end point where I want to create the section from. These dotted lines tells me how deep I look into in the 3D model. And maybe I want to look all the way through the model like this. I could also go to view, click on section and do the same. Click a starting point and the end point for the section. If I want to look this, I can click on this icon to flip it, these two arrows. When I have created a section, I can click on it, right click, go to view, or I could just open this new submenu section here and click on section one is this one and section two is the other one I created. Now we have a problem here because as default masses, the category of masses is turned off. To solve this problem, I can press VV, get to the visibility settings, turn on the mass and click OK. Second, we cannot see all the model. There's some kind of frame that is cutting something away. By clicking on this, we can dragging up by selecting the blue control point here and move it up. We could also just go to the, our properties. Now I haven't selected anything. So this is the properties of the view. Then I can go down here on extents, deselect the crop view and crop region, then it will not crop the view. And now we see our section with the levels icons. These I can turn on, off by right click, hide in view, hide category, then it will turn all the levels icon off in this view. And I could do the same with the section, right click, hide in view, category. And now I have a very clean section that is easier for export. Another tip for creating section, if you have a model that is not totally parallel to the X and Y axis, rotate it manually here. And I want to have a section that is totally parallel to the model. I can try to create a section, but I cannot snap to any geometry. That's a little bit annoying. I need to do something first. I go to architecture create a reference plane, then I can select and snap to some of the geometry inside the model in this way. Then I can select the reference plane I made. And if I want to select something and not the mask, for example, I can use the tab button and, and I can tap through the different geometrical or objects that is just here where I have the cursor. So I want to select the reference plane, as we can see start written down here when I have the mouse over it and then I can drag it in this way. And if I go back to view and create section, now I can snap. I can snap to a reference plane, but not a some geometry or lines in the model, unfortunately. Then I can flip it, move it just by dragging it, extend the view. And another thing, there's a um, difference between the line is just some graphical on the drawing and the blue dotted the actual section so now I can move it into the model in this way and adjust the depth of the section and go to this new section tree that is totally parallel to the model. And again, on the visibility settings, we need to turn off on the mass and deselect the extents, the cropping. Then we have the view again. 